All right, welcome back to the normal video we're doing. We're gonna do some old Chryslers here. Um, we're gonna do the 57, 58 Plymouth Furies. But we're gonna start out with these two guys here. These are Chrysler 300s is what they are. Um, this one's missing the rear bump. It's a 57, it's missing the rear bumper. They're, these are like M2, like early M2, but they say Crestline on the bottom of them. And it's a 57 Chrysler 300. And it has an opening hood. And they have opening doors on them too. So they're pretty cool. Um, I picked these up. Well, I picked these things up a while back. Some lady had a bunch of cars. And I think I gave her like $10, $10 or $15 for everything she had. And these were in there. These 57 Chrysler 300 Crestline. This one's missing the front bumper. That one's missing the rear bumper. This one's missing the front. But I mean, they're they're still pretty cool. And does the hood open? the hood doesn't open on the green one, does it? The white one, the hood open real easy. The green one doesn't seem like the hood wants to open on it. Yeah. Or the doors. What's the deal with that? Uh, this or is the like doors a, are sealed. This is like a drag car. Look at the, the the thick wheels in the back. Yeah. It's got a plastic base, 57 Chrysler 300. Or the doors aren't supposed to come out, come open. So this one here is a drag car almost like with these big wheels in the back. I didn't even realize it had these big wheels back there. Oh, this time I've had the car and didn't even realize it. But these are, yeah, these are Crestline, which I think Crestline was before, then they changed to M2. So they're like real early yeah, M2s. This is front bumper. Yeah, one's missing the front bumper, one's missing the rear bumper. Kind of weird, yeah, I know it's the opposite. What are you going to do? It is what it is, you know. And then this is Hot Wheels Chrysler 300 right here. This is a Hot Wheels. It's metal on metal, and it's got rubber wheels on it. This is a signature car, ain't it? Doesn't this one have a signature on it, Tommy? It mm. should have the signature on it somewhere. Right here. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, because this is from that 30 pack that I have. And it's got the tail lights done in the back. The thick white walls. It's a real nice casting here. This is they don't make this car hardly at all. I think we missed one. Uh there should be a purple one from the cool classic series. Mm. We must have missed that one. It's purple. Yeah. I don't recognize it. Yeah, well it's not the cars. Yeah, it's kind of a and then we got these two. These are Matchbox. These are the 59 uh, Dodge. 59 Dodge. Um, what is it? It's a uh, Dodge Cornet. Dodge Cornet. Since we're doing 50s cars, I figure we'll put these in. Then, you know, these Dodges along with the, those 300s. And then we'll do the Furies, too. All these are kind of... They're all kind of based on the same body style car, more or less. Same platform. You know, just a different name. One says Chrysler, one says Dodge, one says Plymouth. But they're all basically the same. And these are the only four-door cars we got there in this group. And they're pretty cool. I like these police cars. They're, I'm glad they came out with it. Hopefully, I'll put out a few more of these uh, big old Dodge Cornets. Yeah. I like them. I like these old, some of these older 50s, 60s. Now we'll do the basic, the Hot Wheels here. Start out with this guy. This is a Mickey Mouse one. And then Hot this was a, uh, what is this, a Walmart series stuff. And then this is the 2020 Flame Car. Most of these are just, you know, they're putting those, uh, most of these Plymouth Hot Wheels just puts them in their series. And then this was a Avengers car. Yeah, the Avengers. This one is. Got gray plastic base. I'm missing the Treasure Hunt one. There's a Treasure Hunt car like this too. I don't have it. It's in red. Be nice to get that one one, one of these days. Yeah. Pick up that Treasure Hunt car. The regular Treasure Hunt? Yeah, the Super's too much money. I can't afford the Super. I think the regular treasure hunt's kind of pricey too. 
I don't think it's very cheap. I'm gonna have a couple more. What's that first one? Is that what does that one say on there? Uh, it's like a kind of like a disc decade one. It's like a decades. Oh, this is a rock and roll. This is like I don't know. This is some weird series that Hot Wheels put out, and uh, so it's a jukebox. So you have like a a Delta Blues, a Swing, Rock and Roll, Soul, Disco, New Wave, Grunge, and Hip Hop. So there's a bunch of different ones. I know I have the New Wave El Camino, and I think I have Disco Javelin. I might have the Swing 49 Fleet line. I don't know if I have the 68 El Camino or the Shelby GT. So this is the Rock and Roll. 57 Plymouth. All right here. And then, what was, this was a freight car, right? Yeah. Yeah, freight cars. Halloween Yeah. car. It says Plymouth. And the 13, it's got this uh, skull on the hood. Plastic base, but it has rubber tires on it. It's got rubber tires on this one. It's got like ghost flames on the side, and the skull in the back. This is a pretty cool one, this perp, this red one. I'd say the red one's probably the best out of all of them, yeah. and all the Hot Wheel ones. And then maybe the Flames car. So that's done with the cheaper cars. Now we'll get into some more nicer oh, ones. Gosh. These are Auto World. We'll start out with Auto World. The rest of them from here on out are all the, the newer collectors ones instead of the uh, the cheap stuff so this is the first auto world one we're going to look at this is a like a beige colored car and that's the back of it the base and deep nice uh nice base on these really detailed on the bottom and the front end Opening hood, and it doesn't want to stay open. Looks like it's got dual carbs on it. Got two air cleaners underneath there. It's a tan light version, and here's a green version. A darker green, white top, green interior. Same motor as the other one. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it's got dual air cleaners on there, two air cleaners. Nice detailed base. Not sure what it says on the license plate. Can't read the license plate. Won't focus in. Then we have this white version with a red roof, and it's got red and white interior, two tone interior on this one. This one's nice, the white one looks really good. It opens on that. Can't really, there it is. The, so they all have the same motor under the hood, it looks like. Yeah. Uh, let's see, I wonder which, which two go together. Oh. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure which ones are A and B. The white one and green one go together. The what? Sorry. They These both two, say 2017. They both say 2017. And this one here says 2016. Okay, so I'm missing one from 2016 then. Yeah. Okay. I don't know how many of the uh, Auto Worlds I'm missing. I know I don't have too many of the Christine one. ones. And then we have these two cars. These are newer ones here. These are probably what, 2019? 2020, probably. No? 2020 or 2019? Yes, one of those two. It should say it on there, on the card. Mm -hmm. This is a light green. That one's version B. Yeah, what year? Uh, I don't see. It should say on there. At least one. Hey, this hood doesn't open. Hey, they sealed the heat. Up. They sealed the hoods on these. Maybe these are 20, 2020 or twenty nineteen. They don't. They don't have opening hoods anymore. You don't. Nope. Oops. Can you fix this? 
I kind of bumped it. Premium Louis Series 1. Oh, it doesn't have a year on there, does it? Misty Green. Yeah, I guess not. Well, I'll be darned. wonder why they stopped putting the year on there. Oh, 2020. These are 2020s. Oh, the yeah. release one. So this is 2020. And here's the red version. The red one looks like the Christine car, but it's not a Christine car. It's just a red version with the, with the silver down the center. White roof. And they they sealed the hoods on on these newer ones. Yeah. I don't know why they did that. Oh. Maybe it's cheaper to make them. Then we're going to do uh, some green lights. This is uh, the dirt. One in the dirt and, the, and then the clean version. And these are green lights. So here's the dirty car. Oh, it feels dirty too. Pretty awesome. Yeah. Do these have opening hoods? Nope, no opening hoods on these. This one is number 391. It's got a lot, of, a lot of detail on the bottom of these green light ones too. That is pretty cool the way they got it all dirty. This is an actual car that they dug out of the ground. Hmm. I think that's what this is based on. The car was buried for I don't know how many years on the ground. And here's the Why? cleaned up version of it. In how gold. Was it down there? How was it down there? Yeah. I Whoa. have no idea why? why somebody would bury it. Yeah. A car like that. I don't know. This one's 1609. Mm. I know that it's pretty cool. interesting that it was it was buried in the ground. Yeah. I don't know, it doesn't show a picture of it buried in the ground. There's a video I think on YouTube where they dug it up out of the ground. Yeah. And this is the Meekum Auctions right here, Meekum Auctions. And it sold for it sold for seventy one thousand. Wow. There you go. That one's kinda cheap considering how most of them sell for. Oh, this one just doesn't want to come out. A little tougher to get that one out, huh? Yeah. And this is kind of a, a beige colored one. With white walls. It's a nice car. 1129. It's got a little thicker tires on it. They're blacked out. The Black Bandits next. Yes. All right. Well, like tan ones. Yeah. Yeah. Guessing this car mostly came in red and tan. Black. I know it seems like it, right? Well, the Auto World ones are supposed to be uh, actual colors, so you figure there's white and two different greens, the red and the tans, and whatever other one I'm missing. And this is the Black Bandit series car here. It's all, it, I, I, I looked at it, I said, oh man, the black one looks awesome. It looks great in black. Yeah. 1129. It just looks great in black. Really it does. nice. And then. Awesome car. I don't know, I think the black one's the best of them all. Maybe. 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 So far. The black no. one's cool. The and then. Christy. I have three Christines. Um, first one's a green light Christine. And it's the only, and that's the clean up version. A nice clean one. And green light. The ultra red for the one that was on fire. Man. Yeah. The, it, it has like, there's like no difference. No difference. No difference in the auto, in the, uh, Ultra red. red. Yeah, for that one. And this one here, 2409, that's the Chris, yeah. actual Christine This car. one is, kind of doesn't really have a difference either. Yeah. No. And this is the, uh, under repair version. The one I'm missing that I'd like to get is the one that says for sale on it. I don't have that one. I should have bought it when I first seen it and I didn't buy it. Where did you see it? When it first came out. 
Now you look on eBay and it's not on eBay anywhere. Nobody's got them. This is all dusty. This is cool. Look at that. So we have three different versions. This thing feels weird. Yeah, I heard it. it yeah, it, it, I heard it had a weird feeling to it. it. It does feel weird. It feels like it's all crispy, like it's all burnt, like they burnt it. Yeah. That is pretty wild looking. That is such a wild looking car. The way they did Ace that. Ace Auto did the ruined ones for us. Yeah, the uh, um. Yeah, I think the I think the one that's the for sale car I think is an, a green uh, a green light I think. Mm. See now that that's a that's a newer green light version. I don't have yeah. the original green light, Christine. This is a like a second round, uh, Christine. Hmm. Yeah, wow. I know. I didn't buy one for a long time. I don't know I why I didn't could. buy one. But introduce this one too. Yeah. It it does it looks like a Christine car actually, it's it it's just Auto World's version but not the Christine version. But it does look like it's it fits right in with all the rest of them as a Christine yeah. version. So, do you ever see that movie, Tommy? No. You should watch it. It's a it's a pretty cool movie. What was it? Oh, about? the hood opens on those. Uh, not on this one. It yeah. opens up on this one, huh? Yeah. That's weird. And there's the motor. <laughs> That's weird. This one opens, but the other one doesn't. Interesting. Oh, these two are sealed in. This one here. Uh, yeah, um, uh, the green light one, I don't think has an opening hood. But see, the older, these older, um, these, all, these older auto worlds have opening hoods. The older ones. Yeah. And thin wheels. Interesting. A little interesting how that is. Pretty cool though. Yeah. I like my old Plymouths. Hope you enjoyed the video. Comment down below. Subscribe, hit the bell button, hit like, and see you on the next video. I'll see you guys on the next Bye. video. Drive safe. Bye.